What's up YouTube? This is Brad from Alter Reality Games here to do our Magic 2012 box break and we're going to give away the contents of this box on our Facebook page. It's fresh off the truck. Uh, came out today on uh, Friday. Uh, all your pre-orders will start shipping today and you can order it and it's in stock now. So uh, we'll post the video, you'll see it, and once it's posted, we will make an announcement on the page what cards we're giving away each day. All you got to do is leave a comment, and you are enrolled to win the card out of the box. The first 12 or so packs, I'll show you the commons, and then towards the end, we won't show them anymore. Uh, Sun Petal Grove is our first rare. We got a foil in the first pack as well, Worm's Tooth. Uh, this set's very good. It's got three brand new Planeswalkers in it. Hunter's Insight's a, a new card. I think it's very good for green. Uh, we got our first Mythic is Sun Titan. And a foil Doom Blade. Foil Doom Blade's pretty nice too. Probably about a four or five dollar card. Especially with uh, blue black control regaining popularity. Uh, there's also a couple other good cards that are new. Uh, Riddle, um, lose my train of thought, it's hard to do at the same time. Oblivion Ring, uh, Honor of the Pure. Visions from Beyond is very good for blue. Fog makes a return. World Slayer from Mirrodin, that's a reprint. There's a new format that Wizards might actually make uh, legal. It's called Modern. I don't know. They, they play it online, but they might, they're talking about making it a legal format. Ponder's reprinted as well, very nice. Uh, it's where you could use cards from Mirrodin up uh, that have the new card border looking like this. We got a foil rare Rune Scar Demon and a Warstorm Surge, both new cards. I know TCG player at their uh, $75,000 tournament is going to do a modern tournament for uh, $2,000. You can come to our TCG player qualifier in a week and a day on the July 12th or July 23rd, sorry, Drawn Catacomb. All five of those lands are back uh, in this set as well. So that's very nice. Ponder again. Oh, we're getting a Planeswalker. Here we go. Gary Primal Hunter. Let you read him. Uh, he's the third best card money-wise in the set. I think the best Planeswalker is Chandra. He's about a $28 card right now. So that'll be a good prize for someone to win. Arachnus Spinner, another foil. We've been getting a lot of foils already, so that's good. Lightning Bolt didn't get reprinted, unfortunately for you red players, but Incinerate's back. Scramble Verse. It's a brand new one. Sanger Vampire made a return as an uncommon instead of a rare. Smallpox made a return too. Very solid card. Uh, that's going to change a lot of things. Visions from Beyond. Uh, it's one of the best rares in the set. Uh, going for around six bucks. Draw a card if there's 20 or more cards in a uh, in the graveyard. Uh, draw three. No, oh, rope's it down. Suture goal, a reprint from uh, Odyssey Block. 
This is pack number 12, so we're a third of the way through the box after this, and we already got a Garruk. Lord of the Unreal. He's brand new. Very solid card. Illusions get plus one, plus one, and a hex proof. Someone at the pre release got one of those and uh, the phantasmal image out on me. It was hard to deal with. Uh, Throne of Empires. There's three thrones in the set. The other two are on commons. If you have one of each one, their effects get boosted. Incinerate. There's Incinerate. Rights of Flourishing, a uh, reprint from, I think, Shadowmoor. All right, I'm going to stop showing the commons. We'll just do the uncommons and the rares now. Brand new Land Buried Ruin. Day of Judgment makes a comeback again. So your Wrath effect is still uh, in standard for you white players. Goblin Grenade uh, is back. A lot of people are uh, happy that this card's back, and some people are mad, but I think it's neat. I always like that card. Uh, Grave Titan is our next mythic. All the Titans made a return. Uh, also notice Oblivion Ring's an uncommon now, and not a common anymore. New card, Gideon's Avenger. Whenever a creature or an opponent becomes tapped, it gets a plus one, plus one counter. So he can get big pretty fast. There's that phantasmal image. I haven't got any swift foot, uh, swift foot boots yet. Kind of surprising. That's the new light injuries, but a little bit better in some ways, but it cost one to equip instead of free. Garruk's Horde. Um, that's also the card for the release event if you come uh, tomorrow on Saturday. With alternate art. The Birds of Paradise. You can't have a core set without him nowadays. Another Sanger Vampire, another Smallpox, Dragon Skull Summit, Foil Giant Spider, only card to be in every single core set. Soren Markov. So Soren Gideon are reprinted, and then the Jace, the Chandra, and the Garrick are brand new. Liliana and a Johnny. Say goodbye to corsets. Doubling chant. Brand new one. This is pack number 24. Uh, the angel. Also got spirit mantles. Pretty nifty and uh, limited. Uh, gets plus one, plus one, and uh, protection from creatures. That might be that's really hard to deal with in a booster draft or sealed deck in a core set anyway. Another suture gold. We already got him. Reverberate, reprint it again for the first time. First reprint. Time Reversal, that's reprinted from M11. Got quite a few Mythics, I think, already, like five. If we get another Mythic, we'll probably be lucky. Zombie Infestation makes a comeback. Uh, a lot of, this used to be a huge card, and 
extended in type one. Now you can play it in standard again. Adaptive automation is a very good card. It's about five bucks. Let you read that. There's Goblin Grenade again. Elvis Archdruid. Makes a return once again. Jace is still eluding us. Uh, Monomania. Uh, player discards every card they have but one. Mesa Enchantress makes a return from Player Chaos and M10. Got another foil. There, we finally got a Swift Foot Boots. Quick Silver Amulet and a foil Deathmark. That's not a bad pack. That's a reprint from, I think, Urza's Block or something like that. Dejana Wishes makes a return from M10. Three packs to go. Mind Unbound. Keep drawing more and more cards each turn. Two packs to go. Overrun made a return. Vengeful Pharaoh is our uh, rare. Brand new. A lot of zombies and vampires in this set. Last pack. Foil in it. Rootbound Craig and Wither Withering Flesh. It's the last pack. So we're gonna give all these cards away on our Facebook uh, or on our Facebook page uh, starting on Friday night. So when we post it, just sign up and leave a comment, and you'll be entered to win. And then we'll pick out the winners each day and notify you, and then we'll ship your cards out to you. So the best one to get's a Garuk in this, but someone's gonna get a free twenty-eight dollar card, which is nice because it's free. And then you also get a lot of other solid cards like the Lands and Soarin' and Sun Titan. So M11s in, or M12s in stock, and you could buy it now. All the single cards are in stock. You could buy it, and your pre-orders started shipping. So have a good one. Sign up to win the cards.